Hi students, I am Dr. Badrinath and uh, today is very small and sweet topic that is respiratory stimulants. Agents are medicines that stimulates the respiration, respiratory system. And uh, <clears throat> one of the wonderful example is the coffee. Coffee. See, actually, morning when we will wake up, we are very lazy. Very, very, very lazy. But if you have a cup of coffee or tea, tea also consists of caffeine. Coffee also consists of caffeine. So, caffeine is a common constituent both in the coffee as well as the tea. So, whenever you are taking a morning one cup of coffee, our brain will be stimulated because coffee is a wonderful CNS stimulant, central nervous system stimulant. Coffee, very important bit that is. Not only central nervous system, it stimulates the respiratory center also. Respiratory center which is present in the medulla. Medulla. Okay? Right. So now we will see what are these uh, respiratory stimulants uh, chapter. Okay. Uh, we are moving as per the syllabus. Here you can be find the respiratory stimulants. Uh, this is my uh, mobile app. All my YouTube contents, all my notes will be available. Now it is uh, open for all. It is a uh, 99% free, this mobile app also. You can go to Google Play Store and you can be download it. App. This is mobile app. This is a symbol. Uh, this is a 99% free. This app is uh, for students only. Very affordable, very low cost. It is just like a M Pharmacy 100 rupees, B Pharmacy 250 rupees only. Uh, Pharma D also 250 rupees. Uh, all the important subjects are already uploaded. Okay, here after opening app, you go to store option here. In my app, in my mobile app, at the bottom, you go to the store option. There you can find all the list. Uh, all these are the top selling, B pharmacy, top selling, PharmD, M pharmacy, so things like that. Uh, uh, but uh, still some subjects has to upload that I will upload uh, one by one, no problem. Uh, and here, this is my YouTube channel. Here you can go to the playlist in my uh, YouTube channel, playlist. In the playlist, I have kept all subject wise, uh, social and preventive pharmacy, 47 videos are there, complete subject, pharmacology, 26 videos, complete subject. Like that, uh, all the things is already available uh, in my YouTube channel. That is 100% free. Respiratory stimulants, introduction, also called as a analeptics. Analeptics. See here, analeptics. Hmm? These are the uh, these are nothing but a chemical agents or these are the drugs which stimulates the respiratory system. That is very, very important. That's why name is very clear title, respiratory stimulants. They restores... They stimulate the respiration or restores the normal respiration. Some In some cases, like a corona attack, like a lungs, okay? The patient was unable to take the breath. In such a cases, respiratory stimulants can give, okay? With the doctor's uh, session and advice. So, it restores the normal respiration when lungs are unable to do normal respiration. They have a resuscitative value, resuscitative, resuscitative. What is this resuscitative value? It is nothing but uh, whenever that is a the childbirth, whenever there was a childbirth, in some cases, in some cases, what happened? Uh, there, there was no proper breath. There was no proper breath. In such a cases, they will give the injection, resuscitative injection. Uh, uh, resuscitative means bringing back to the life, bringing back to the life. Okay, that's why this concept is very, very important. These are called as a analytics, resuscitative value. And, and uh, be careful whenever you are uh, choosing a dose. Here the dose is uh, uh, never give a overdose. If you give an overdose, this will be happen. It stimulates the central nervous system, I have already told. Uh, respiratory stimulants will stimulate the brain also, see with CNS also, and it leads to epilepsy like this. Okay, that's why this is very, 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 very important and very carefully you have to handle. At low doses, they stimulate the respiration. At high doses, they produce the convulsions, coma, painting. They have a narrow therapeutic window. See here, small range in the dose. If you just increase small, even 1 mg also, it leads to uh, that's why margin of safety is very narrow. That's why these are very dangerous. Uh, hence, instead of giving a respiratory stimulants whenever the patient is need, uh, give a mechanical support like a oxygen concentrators, 
like mechanical support, uh, inhalers, oxygen uh, mask, or uh, like that, you can be given, right? And uh, they also stimulate the central nervous system. That's why also called as a CNS stimulant. They stimulates the chemoreceptors, not only chemoreceptors, vasomotor center also. This vasomotor center is responsible for the regulation of blood vessel diameter. So that is increasing BP or increasing, decreasing a, a BP that depends upon uh, diameter of the blood vessel. Okay. They also stimulate the branchi, trachea, lungs by irritating the epithelial lining. There was epithelial cells will be there like this. See, branchi, trachea. These are the epithelial cells. Some are ciliated, non-ciliated, whatever it may be. All these types of cells are uh, uh, irritated, irritated by the uh, these things, and that's why it stimulates the lungs for problem. So not only it stimulates the CNS, so it stimulates the chemoreceptor, vasomotor, uh, branchi, respiration, etc. Now, yeah, this is a classification. Among all the drugs, only two drugs are important. Very, very, very uh, three you can take. Three drugs are very, very important. Uh, see here classification. Based on the mechanical action, directly activating the respiratory center, uh, which is present in the medulla, like a caffeine, coffee bite, coffee, all these things. Caffeine tablets also available. Most of the students they do not know uh, coffee is available only these two form. They do not know that coffee is available in the form of tablets. It is available. See here, caffeine tablets are available. Uh, the coffee tablets also you can be take. Uh, Doxa prem. Uh, prem, you can remember in the Hindi prem, P R E M prem means it is a love. So love symbol you can be keep in your mind. You love coffee like that you can remember. So both names at a time you can be keep coffee, caffeine, prem, doxa, prem. Uh, Bemgride, etimazol, uh, lobelin. This is a plant name is a lobelin. Very very important in pharmacognosis subject. Lobelin resuscitative value. It is having a resuscitative value. It brings back the life. Most of the doctors, they will think that child is died. But specialists, they will come and they will give the lobilin, lobilin injection. So that immediately the, he will wake up. This, uh, the child is, will be wake up. That much of powerful plant. This is just like Sanjeevini. Lobilin is a Sanjeevini plant. And the drugs which shows the mixer type of action. Here, this is reflex action. It shows the reflex. This is uh, stimulates the respiratory center. Uh, Nikitamide, carbogen. Okay, but only three are important. Remaining all are need not to be uh, keep in your mind for competitive examination. For regular exam, if you write one or two example, that's more than sufficient. More than sufficient because the topic is very small. Uh, here also we are going to cover only coffee and uh, dogs of frame only. Remaining and all uh, not much important. Lobelin is somewhat important. Uh, Lobelin, this is dogs of frame. It is a short acting respiratory stimulant. Very short acting. Immediately it starts. Kick start. Kick starts, you can say. Okay. Short acting respiratory stimulant. Excites the central nervous system. Stimulates the respiratory center in the medulla. It stimulates the carotic and aortic chemoreceptors, which are present uh, baroreceptor and chemoreceptors that you know, wonderful concept in pharmacology. They have adverse effect that causes, causes the nausea, vomiting, coughing, restlessness. Uh, because CNS is stimulating. Uh, so always you are active, active, active. So you'll feel that restlessness. Okay. And advice, use in acute respiratory failure. Whenever respiratory system is failure, then you can give the doxa frame. Love. A respiratory, uh, this is a low dosis only. You have to give all CNS, uh, all these respiratory stimulants. It is selective for respiratory center. Promote the excitation of central neurons. So respiratory stimulation will happen. This is mechanism of action. Stimulates through the carotid and aortic body chemoreceptor. So respiratory stimulation will be there. Falling in the BP rises. Falling BP. Whenever BP is fell down, that BP will be rises by giving this uh, doxa prep. So it rises the BP. Just imagine. So this is, uh, you can say it is uh, one of the medicine for low BP patients. Okay. Right. And uh, caffeine. That is the next one, uh, also called as a methyl xanthin. This is sometimes it is called as a methyl xanthin alkaloid. It is alkaloid. Uh, it is a found in the coffee. It is found in the tea. Mechanical action is it inhibits the phosphodiesterase enzyme. Phosphodiesterase enzyme. So there was an accumulation of the camp, just like a fire camp. You can keep in your mind. 
fire camp camp means cyclic adenosine monophosphate and it uh, leads to increased uh, sensitivity of respiratory center to the carbon dioxide okay uh, carbon dioxide gives the signal okay so that uh, sensitivity of your medulla respiratory center will be increased that is a wonderful mechanical action further it acts as a adenosine receptor this is adenosine receptor see here this adenosine receptor was uh, Uh, this receptor was blocked by caffeine so caffeine come and sit here caffeine inactivates the adenosine receptor so that there is no response it results in the stimulation whenever there was no response of this receptor stimulation will be there okay so it prevents the death uh, due to the sleeping apnea it is a disease sleeping apnea the patient in the sleep itself he will die that is called a sleeping apnea okay death in the Sleep. Those type can be prevented by using this methyl hexanthin. So coffee early morning you have to take a coffee. So I will end my session here. So keep watching playlist and download the app now itself.